Okay, this is going to be a process. What I highly recommend is you write it down on a piece of paper, kind of like you're writing a letter to them. It's rehearsal time because once you write it out, now say it out loud so you can really hear yourself get the words coming out of your mouth or it's not coming out of your mouth. Maybe it's through text message. So regardless, we need to get this out, read it over and over again so that it matches what you're talking about, that it sounds respectful and it sounds as nice as you can put it. Some things to keep in mind, nobody likes to be turned down. So keep that in your mind and put yourself in their shoes. If you feel like it's the best type of message that you can give. And I had a couple questions. I don't know if this is someone that you've been dating for a long time, someone you're in a relationship with, or it's early on in the dating experience. Knowing them so far, you can kind of gauge how they would react. And I just want to give you the permission that you're doing the best that you can. And through rehearsing and writing it over, saying it out loud to you over and over again, it will allow you to really process and adjust what needs to be adjusted. A template that I usually follow is the sandwich method, of course. There's like some sort of acknowledgement, some intention. In the middle is like the truth, what you need to speak on. And then you end it with as much kindness and respectfulness as much as possible. And there you go. Take a look at this as a growth exercise. There's going to be more experiences where you need to clear it up to someone. So know that this is an opportunity for you to grow and learn how to process and rehearse what you need to say. This really allows you to practice not to be so impulsive and just going in there and boom, saying what you wanna say. That's not respectful, that's not nice, that's not kind, right? This is definitely a character building exercise. Thank you for your question. Let me know if there's anything else that you want me to clarify on. And uh, yeah, stay tuned everybody for more.